Hello and welcome back to Satisfactory. And uh, today we're going to make high speed connectors. And we're going to do it here. Now this isn't going to be a big, a large factory here. We're just going to get enough to play with. Um, just a little bit. and But we're going to make it expandable. We're working with normal nodes here. And we don't have very many nodes. So... I think we're going to wind up with like 14 per minute high-speed connectors. I did the math. We're going to use silicon high-speed connectors. I think we'll get more out of that. We have some quartz nearby. But our main bottlenecks here are going to be quick wiring quartz. We're going to need copper, but not a whole lot of it. So we're going to do it right here. We got the quick wire and copper. And right there, we've got quartz. Okay, we'll do it at around this level. That's fine. We're just going to do... You can see on the right, I... Uh, I have a little list of what I want to do. We can start with the... Katarium, I guess. I need six smelters. For Katarium. And I want to put each thing... Each product on its own separate level just so it makes it easier to expand in the future if I want to. Okay, let's get six smelters. I think I did the uh, math right. I hope I did. Now, I think this... Katarium... It's a normal node. I think I'm going to have to overclock it. Did I? Not? Oh, yeah. Of course it's not lined up. Why would it be? Okay, so Katarium, yeah, we're going to need like 240 for all this, I think. That's a Mark III belt. Forty-five per minute. That's 270. Uh, yeah, that's a Mark III. Right? Yeah, 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 270. Okay. Copy and paste the settings. Whoops. Okay. 
that in the right spot? That's not quite right. Ah, I got it. It doesn't really matter. I just... I like all the power poles to be... It bothers me if they're not just in the right spot, but I know I'll never see it. Okay, well, that's fine. should be there. That should be there. There we go. Okay. Alright, let's get the... Uh, oh, that's fine. We'll leave that where it is. Got the Katarium there. Are you Katarium? Yes, you are. Now we're going to have to upgrade you. And I've got some power shards because I'm going to need 240 Katarium per minute. And we're getting 120. That's going to bump up the power consumption a bit. That's fine. I do think there's a pure Katarium node a little ways away. I could just use that, but maybe I'll use that for something else. And once I get a Mark III Miner, we can just remove the power shards if I want to. Uh, where... got lost. Okay, I, I want to go out this way. There we go. Are we making Katarium? Now I need seven constructors. Making quick wire. There are some alternate quick wire recipes. There's one that uses um, combined catarium and copper. Looks like it could be interesting, um, but then I'd have to use more copper. My copper wouldn't be enough. So there's always going to be some bottleneck here with how little we have to work with. Now each constructor takes 12 per minute. You output 15 Okay. I mean, I could just underclock them. Uh, 
add another one, then underclock them. Uh, yeah, let me just... Just so it's a one-to-one -one ratio here. Just to make it easier to work with. Well, then I'd have to line... Well, never mind. I'd have to remove all the smelters and put them back down again. Get them all to line up. Alright, let's... uh Get a merger... All right, we got the Katarium going on the first floor here. I decided to line up the smelters and the constructors. I underclocked these slightly, so we're producing 12 per minute, which is what these are consuming. So it just makes it a little, a little bit cleaner. They have this one-to-one -one ratio. Now we're getting like 480 something wires per minute. Okay, uh, next thing, copper ingots and copper sheets. Um, copper sheets are 20, consume 20. For a minute. Okay. We can do a similar thing here. I like having this one to one ratio. Okay, we'll start. I guess at the end here. Constructor. Yeah, I find this uh, easier to work with. Where do we have the constructors down here? Oh, okay. down there that does the smelters don't i think the smelters are a little further over that's okay this is just a lot easier than Combining the ingots with mergers and then resplitting them. get power to the second floor well, we don't have a lot of constructors to work with so uh, yeah not a lot of buildings to work with so it's it's not it's not taking very long we should be able to get this up and running 
pretty quickly. Uh, copper sheet. Did I set all of these? Yeah. There's the copper. Okay, now the copper sheets are going to assemblers, and so are so is the quartz. Let's get the quartz done. Okay, now the quartz will need six constructors making silica. There's the quartz down there. We're gonna start at this end again. Uh, one, two... Okay. Right here. There we go. Now, I think I'm going to need 120. Uh, yeah, 120 quarts per minute, which is fine. We're using the Mark II Miner, so that'll be okay. Uh, my hotkeys aren't working. Uh, what happened? Oh, no. Hockeys are broken. I'll have to look into that. Weird. Okay, now they're working. Oh, that's weird. I don't know what I did to fix it. Or break it. Why is that copper sheets? Oh, I pasted. Okay, I think I pasted. There we go. Pasted the wrong recipe. Now my hotkey's not working again. Is it? Is it because I pasted something? Hang on a minute. What did I do? I'm pressing all the buttons.
Okay, now I can. It's something to do with copying and pasting recipes. Oh, that's weird. Huh. Very odd, if I say so myself. to find out exactly how to reproduce it and submit it as a bug. No. I don't want a new pole. Catch it to that one. There we go. Okay, it's going to be a little bit awkward. Um... Gotta get the quartz. Over here. Um, now, I think, if I remember correctly, this quartz... Is it still... Okay, it's not coming... Down the track. There's a problem in here. I think I hooked it up. For the wrong power. I've got a biomass burner in there. That I was using before. And I think I hooked it up to that one. And it ran out. Ran out of power. Are the bugs back? They might be back. They're not. That's good. These two are being used for oscillating crystals. This one back here. Is the one I want to use. There we go. Uh, not that one. That is Sam, which we'll use later. This one. Yep, we got a green light. Okay, we're good. Let's head back and finish this thing. All right, we've got one assembler here making circuit boards. 12 and a half per minute. It doesn't seem like a lot, but it'll be enough. Uh, we've got some silicon coming from the top floor. I think we might need like 13.5 per, per minute. I, I think I might overclock this a little bit. We'll see. But anyway, I've got some manufacturers. I need five. One, two... Oh, they're big. Oh, they're big. Um, can I get rid of you?
Okay, let's select your recipe. We're doing the silicon high-speed connectors. We've got three inputs. Three items to input here. I messed this one up. Um, no, that's right. Okay. We got all the splitters. We need 90 quick wire. Two, cir three circuit boards per minute. Yeah, we don't need very many. Circuit boards are going here. All right. Um, what else did we need? We need the silica and quick wire. Silica is up there. up my hot bar here. Number five is a merger. Number six splitter. There we go. Is that right? Uh, yeah, that looks level. There's a little bit of clipping there, but... Who cares? Can use a conveyor lift. There we go. Okay, last thing is the quick wire. That's all down there. And it's a lot of quick wire, right? Yeah, 90 per minute. Ugh. I gotta use my tier 4 belt. Um, 
Oh, I hope I have enough encased industrial beams. Um, does the silicon need to be? Let's see, 37.5. Does that need a tier 4 belt? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. 6 times 37.5225 Okay. Yeah, let's change that. I don't have um Encased industrial beams going into a dimensional depot yet. So, yeah, there is a danger of me running out. Okay, is that going to be enough? Maybe. downgrade these as well. Yeah, there's a few things I don't have going into a dimensional depot yet, which uh, we need to do. Okay, let's use a Mark II lift. We gotta get these belts. There we go. Okay. Now we gotta get the quick wire up there. Which is pretty easy. Just feed it feed it right there. Zoomies. There it goes, it's zooming in. That's not right. Are they working? They need more silica. Yeah, we should have enough coming in. What's the craft time? 40 seconds. And all of this should net me about... Oh god, I don't even know how many. Three per minute and there's five, so 15. But it's actually going to be a little bit less. Um, not everything's going to be running 100%. I think it was like 13.5 actual product per minute. Which doesn't seem like a whole lot, but I don't think we're going to need a lot of these things. I really don't know. I just, I needed some. And so I thought I'd build some kind of production facility here. And so that's what I did.
There we go. High speed connectors. I think that'll help me with some research as well. Well, we have a dedicated facility for making high speed connectors. I hope it was worth the effort. I think it will be. I can just leave it alone and let it let her rip. How's my power doing? These manufacturers... Oh. Oh, these manufacturers are tall. Poking through right there. Uh, anyway, power. Uh, max consumption, 4,000 megawatts. Capacity, 3,000 megawatts. So, yes. I think the next thing I need to do is... Expand power. Now the coal power down there, we can get a lot more power out of the coal that's down there. I think it might be time to rework the coal power there. That might be a good thing to do. But uh, yeah, in the meantime, we'll work on coal power and just let this produce some high-speed connectors. I, I don't know if I need them for any kind of production yet. I might. But I know I need them for research and other things. So anyway, that is my high speed connector production facility. About 13, 13, 13.5 per minute. It's not a perfect, I didn't perfectly do the ratios or anything. I'll clean this up so it's a little more uh, presentable. Uh, so everything's not like just floating everywhere. But uh, that's high-speed connectors. All right, thanks for watching, and I'll see you soon.